Hi, I'm Mike Laney. Today we're out here with my 1940 Piper J3 Cub. Uh, this plane started out with a uh, 50 horse Franklin. Uh, it has since over the years they was upgraded to have the 65 Continental. It's hand prop. Not much to this plane as far as maintenance and upkeep. It's pretty simple. Not a whole lot to flight gauges. You got basically your RPM, you got your airspeed, you got altitude, and you got your oil temperature and oil pressure. That's it. And there's not a whole lot. It's prop to start, no electric start, no electrical at all on this aircraft. And other than that, it's a pretty simple to fly. The uh, neatest part about this plane is whenever you do a stall, this is your stall warning right here, the door. Whenever you stall, the door will flap up just as during the stall itself, so you know you're fixing to stall out. Other than that, it's a pretty simple, straightforward little plane. Has a Stromberg carburetor, which was pretty standard on the 65s back when they started putting them on these aircraft. Uh, there is no mixture control. It's all set to full rich. You sit in the back of this one because it doesn't have but a 12 gallon header tank on it. So you fly from the rear whenever you solo. But it's a great plane to fly. It's a lot of fun. And if you ever have the opportunity to get in one of these, even just to take a ride, you gotta do it.